uplifting your spirit through the inspired Word of God. This is your daily devotional. The faith I live by, outpouring of the latter rain. Ask ye of the Lord rain in the time of the latter rain. So the Lord shall make bright clouds and give them showers of rain to every one grass in the field. Zechariah 10, 1. In the east, the former rain falls at the sowing time. It is necessary in order that the seed may germinate. Under the influence of the fertilizing showers, the tender shoot spring up. The latter rain, falling near the close of the season, ripens the grain and prepare it for the sickle. The Lord employs these operations of nature to represent the work of the Holy Spirit. While we cherish the blessing of the early rain, we must not, on the other hand, lose sight of the fact that without the latter rain to fill out the ears and ripen the grain, the harvest will not be ready for the sickle, and the labor of the sower will have been in vain. Divine grace is needed at the beginning, divine grace at every step of advance, and divine grace alone can complete the work. Do not rest satisfied that in the ordinary course of the season, rain will fall. Ask for it. We must seek his favors with the whole heart. If the showers of grace are to come to us, we should improve every opportunity of placing ourselves in the channel of the blessing. Christ has said, where two or three are gathered together in my name, there am I in the midst. Matthew eighteen twenty. The convocations of the church, as in camp meetings, the assemblies of the home church, and all occasions where there is personal labor for souls, are God's appointed opportunities for giving the early and the latter rain. At every meeting we attend, our prayer should ascend that at this very time, God will impart warmth and moisture to our souls. As we seek God for the Holy Spirit, it will work in us meekness, humbleness of mind, a conscious dependence upon God for the perfecting latter rain. If we pray for the blessing in faith, we shall receive it as God has promised. The Holy Spirit will come to all who are begging for the bread of life to give to their neighbors. The Faith I Live By, November 24th. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Thank you all for listening and please join us once again tomorrow for your daily devotional reading. God bless.